Compounding momentum and growth is an important, it's an important um, exercise to wrap your mind around to see how time plays into the success of your business. Okay, so this is what happens. Most people believe that if I do something once, we call this short-term thinking, not long-term thinking. I do something once and it doesn't show up as an instant gratificational effect. It means it's failed. Business is not like this, guys. I often say this to encapsulate this metaphor. What you do today will show up tomorrow. This is long-term thinking, okay? So here's what I mean. This is the thinking we have to have. I'm going to show you how to do this as well, guys. Let's say I do a Facebook Live here. From that Facebook Live, 100 people show up. Now, I would love an instant reaction from that. And in some cases, I get that, where I could do a Facebook Live within a couple of minutes of finishing that live. I get a message from somebody saying they want to work with me. How do, I, how do I join your program? How do I pay score? How do I enroll? That's instant gratification, but that's rare, okay? What I'm expecting to happen is the long-term compounding effect, which means I do a Facebook Live once, okay, on Monday. And then I do it again on Tuesday. I do it again on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and I keep doing it over and over and over. And all I'm doing is I'm placing my full trust in time that a week from now, 10 days from now, two weeks from now, that Facebook Live that I did two weeks ago will turn into paid clients later. This is long-term thinking, okay? I'll give you an example, another real example. I've got YouTube videos, guys, that I created five years ago that are still booking me calls today. Had I not made the choice to make that YouTube video, I wouldn't be receiving the benefits now. And it's not just one YouTube video I made. I've got nearly 800 in my channel, okay? So what I'm doing is I'm doing it once and I'm waiting for this thing to show up later, the output to show up later. I'm putting the input in, watching for the output later. But I'm not just doing it once. I'm gonna do it over and over again. Essentially, I'm putting into effect multiple inputs that will all show up later, okay? So this is what it looks like. Let's say I do one Facebook Live and the time before I see a result of that is a week. Okay, I see some comments see some shares, I see some likes, I see some dislikes, I just ignore them. I keep doing what I need to do. I follow my routine, which I'm going to show you later, guys. I just keep doing my thing. Then from there, out of the blue, from the live I did seven days ago, I get four strategy calls booked. And I can track those things because we're going to specifically ask our clients, where did you find us? That's part of the server. I'm going to show you guys how to set up. So I can track and repeat that thing later. From there, four strategy calls get booked. I do all four. I close it. Let's say 50%. I get two clients. And that's just from that one Facebook Live. That's the Facebook Live I did seven days ago. But what about the two Facebook Lives I did six days ago? Well, on the same day of getting two clients paid, I also get another three strategy calls booked from that Facebook Live I did six days ago, all the way down the line. The stuff I'm, I'm receiving each day is because of the things I did yesterday two days ago, three days ago, I'm compounding its effect. So from one action, I build compounding momentum over time that shows up as a future sale. If I attempt several actions consistently over time, long-term thinking, I'm constantly building compounding effect that shows up consistently every single day. That's the business model that we're running, guys. And that's what I'm going to teach you how to do. However, let me give you the contrast. Let me show you what most people will do, okay? So time, effort, and consistency, long-term thinking, become a potent formula in business. Most therapists and coaches expect instant gratification over long-term effect. They seem to forget the effect of effort over time will keep them in business for the long-term. You must harness the power effect of time and effort and live by its rules. It's cause and effect. There is no human on earth that has abilities outside of time and physics. They all have to abide by those laws. It's what we call compounding success. So this is what happens. Here's that chaotic mess again. They pick a niche for anxiety, okay? They, they're solid on that. They do the research, they pick anxiety. They do one Facebook Live, one YouTube video within a couple of days. They don't get instant gratification. They change the niche. Two days later, they do weight loss. They do the same thing. Nothing shows up. Three days later, they're in relationship niche, a couple of bits of effort, a couple of inputs into the marketing, nothing shows up, they move on, they go to fear, okay? And they niche jump from niche to niche to niche to niche without allowing the time and the effort they put in to show up later, 
no time for compounding effect to show up. Effect equals negative. Okay, but they don't just do it in the niche, then they do this. The chaos also extends into their marketing. One week they're doing paid ads, the next week they're doing funnels, the week after that they're doing podcasts, the week after that they're writing a book, the week after that they're doing guest speaking, the week after that they're networking and then collaboration. And each time they start something, they stop it. They have a hard stop. They stop it completely. They don't allow time to catch up. And not only are they changing their niche every few days, now they're changing their marketing strategy. And then after a month of doing this, I look back, they're exhausted and think, well, I've done so much work. Why has nothing showed up? Because of this, no time for compounding effect to show up. The effect is negative. Lastly is their identity. This is a big one. People jumping from being a coach to a therapist, to a psychic, to a motivational speaker, to a trainer, to having a training school, to one-to-one, -to -one, going back to selling, I don't know, the bullet juicer, going back to handing out business cards. It's just chaotic and all over the place. And there's no time for compounding effect to show up. The effect is negative. So this is a long-winded way for me to say, guys, we're going to make a choice to have one niche, one offer, one price, one direction. And if you stick with that choice long enough and allow time to catch up, you will reap the lion's share. We have to allow time to build this. It's long-term thinking. It's not, what do I get today? It's, what am I going to get tomorrow? But no one does this. No one understands this. Hence why a lot of you guys are probably in this program. We're going to uh, totally change the script on this. So you're thinking in these long-term factors.